Good day, panels. Good day, advisor. So right now, I'll be discussing the admin side of our system. So first off, we will go to our admin. We just need to type an admin like that. And our system will pop up to the admin um, interface login so I will just type in my admin or admin account and as you can see um, it it routes to the next page which is the dashboard or the first page which is the dashboard in the dashboard page um, you will see here the total capstone or thesis that has that has been uploaded and it shows there is nine capstones uploaded on the second um, image you will see here the number of capstones according to their um, categories like in the category of good health and well-being there is one one capstone under under it in quality education there is two capstone in decent work and economic growth this is there is one while in the industry innovation and infrastructure there is five on the third image um next image i mean it will show here it will show here the capstone according to their year published so in 1999, there is one capstone published, 2015, one, 2017, there is one, in 2018, there is three, in 2019, there is two, and the latest is in 2021. On the last image, um, it will show here the top five um no there is only top five so it means there is only five capstones um, mostly were mostly cited so here you will see here that there are two capstone that were mostly cited and there um there is four there's there there are four systems or yeah systems who cited this this capstones so these are the document management systems from current current capabilities towards intelligent information retrieval and records management and electronic records management and before i forgot um this dashboard or in case um, the higher management will ask for a report about this um, system so all we need to do is just print and it will route to the another page and it shows here that um, if you want to print or directly or if you want to print directly to if you want to print directly or we we'll just um you want to just download it so there are some options like this if i want to download this yeah that's it now let's go back to our system and now we will proceed to the next menu of this admin admin page so on the next um, menu is the list of capstone or thesis uploaded in the system so literally you will see here the list of capstone 
with its, its title, authors, category, and the date which it which um, when it was published. Um, you can also search the capstone that you wanted to look for, like um, Middletown. It is um, real time or according to their categories like um, in quality education if you want sy systems or capstone that is under quality education it will show here and then publish date or publish date like in 2021 like that you can also filter like um, this uh, the good health and well-being which is posted I mean there is an option um, where you can filter the category and the date published like um, industry and innovation and when is the date it was published example the date is um, 10 January or October 10 2018 So it will show here the capstone or system that has been published on that um, category and at the, same, at the same time on the date it was published. Now let's proceed to the next feature where the admin can add new capstone and it will route on the next page. And it will ask for the title of the capstone. For example, I have um, exa an example capstone here, which was published. And next, all we need to do is just upload the file or the PDF file of, of this edge capstone. And that and right after that um, the admin just need just needed to save so as we can see here the Luis Hervias management system is now located in the lists now let's proceed to the editing function of our system so if the admin wants to edit or or update any of this informations all we need to do is just to um, click this edit so the admin has um, the option to um, whether he wants to change he want he or she want to change he can also he or she can also um, update the file by just removing this um, remove this file just simply click this remove PDF and upload a new the new file and as we can see here there is a citation and or references in this feature um, it will allow the user to know if um, what system or study it was um, cited in this feature the user is allowed to know what systems it was being cited so it will show here the system or the study it was cited 
and from what page and to the page it was ended and here in details um, the admin can put details or remarks about the set capstone and then he or she can also have the option to remove this citation and if um, the system and if this system cited another system all you need to do is just to click this new citation it will um, it will give you another form or um, blank inputs where you can select all the capstone manage um, all the systems that was uploaded in this so for example I will select this capstone fortune town capstone archive management system so we'll just select that capstone fortune uh, come see fortune town capstone archive management system and from what page did he um, did or she cite um, the system we'll just put it there 18 to 20 and click save updates so what will happen now in the user side or a user interface is that come see in town archiving management management system were cited was or was cited by come see for town e-business system so here in the e-business system was um, where we added that citation And now let's proceed to the next menu, which was the user menu. So it will show here the user, the username of the user, the first name, the middle name of the user, last name, and what type of the user. The admin can... Um, the admin can also edit the said um, infos, can update the user type, the first name, middle name, last name, exact from the username, and we'll ask for the password. And then mean can also delete um, can able to delete any users and here um, to make it easier the admin can search what user also the admin can add new user and just simply save it It will, um, it will show here the new added user. Let's proceed to the next menu, which is the category. So here we'll show all the categories or the sustainable development goals of the said systems. Or she can um, want to look for a sustainable or SDG for example the clean water like this like that he or she can also edit the said um, category he or she can also delete 
um, the category. And lastly, we will um, lastly the system users menu. In here, you will see all the admin um, users of this system. So, and lastly, the system users menu, we can add um, new user, user admin. Just click save. And since it says um, username already exists, all we need to do is just to um, change the username. And now, here it goes. The new um, admin has already um, added. So we will test um, this user and its password in the admin or the back end of the system. So first off, we will just sign out from the system and put the username we just added and its password. So here, the, you, the new admin can access the back end of the system. And that's it for now. Thank you for listening. Good day, panel. And to all the viewers, today I'm going to present to you about our system, the Capstone Archiving Management System of Calmsy Fortune Town Campus. First, I will discuss about on the user login or the user interface. In this section or in this interface, you need to sign in the uh, student account or the faculty account and for example I log in this our sample login of student and press sign in there it is logged in successfully and in this interface, you can see the student's name and the account option. And if you click the profile tab or the profile button, you can edit your information here and click save. And the sign up button. And another here is you can also see the categories or the filter by year and by category and the search function or the search bar. For example, I click all or I choose all of these here and I want to choose one category about the industry and innovation and, and infrastructure and I want to search what keyword title or author I want and if I want to search the word record and I press enter or the search icon it will shows all the result of the record of the word of the keyword record as you can see in here if I drag this cited by you can see all the system or the studies that has been cited from this system the records management and i if i click here it will goes 
to the new tab of that system the one this is the one that cited the records management system in here you can see the abstract of the study or the system and here you can see <clears throat> this system has been cited the records management and if and we go back here and if I drag the, my mouse in here you can see and you can cite this system it is the sample format of referencing the system of this system and if I click this it shows the title of the capstone or the system the author and what publish what date publish it has been the citations and the number of internal cited in this in this system and the category as you can see the abstract of the system is always is also shown and if you click this the pdf file you can also see all the details of the capstone studies or system there and can press ok and if we go back to the home page we click this and it will show the default function if you go back and that's all about on the user interface and for the last if you want to sign out just click sign out and press yes and it will go back to the user interface login